Our first guest here at CES Unveiled travels the world much like we do. In fact, we usually catch up with her as we're traveling the world for various events. And, of course, she's always promoting the consumer electronics industry, as we are as well, and helps make CES the big success that it is every year, along with a whole bunch of other events in her spare time. She is Senior Vice President for Events and Conferences with CEA, the Consumer Electronics Association. Karen Chupka. Karen, welcome into tomorrow. How are you? Great, and thanks for being here tonight. We're very excited to have you broadcasting. Well, thank you. It's, it's a pleasure for us, too. Every year we get this whole uh, feeling of excitement rolls around this time of year as, as you present this press preview, and it's all just uh, to tease us about the big international <laughs> CES coming up. And uh, tell our audience a little bit about what Unveiled here is all about and what we're likely to be hearing and talking about over the next three hours. Sure, absolutely. You know, one of the great things about this event tonight is it's kind of the kickoff to the CES season. And, uh, you know, it kind of helps that it's the second week in November, right before Black Friday coming down the road there. Yeah. So uh, a lot At of least official Black a, Friday, official, the day after Thanksgiving. Correct, not the <laughs> other hundred that are celebrated. Yeah, they've year. been starting in March and April already. It's like, okay, really Black Friday, especially for consumer electronics items, the day after Thanksgiving. Right. <laughs> and, you know, and obviously there's a lot of excitement this fourth quarter about um, what's a great great gift to buy for, for someone over the holidays. And so um, one of the great things that we do tonight is, uh, you know, we come out here and we talk about the upcoming trends that are going to be seen at CES, but we also bring about 40 exhibitors to the floor and we have them start showcasing and talking about some of the cool products. And actually the fun thing about tonight is one of the things that was announced at our press conference tonight is our 2012 Innovations Honorees, which yeah. are the winners of the best awards for CES. And so many of the companies that are exhibiting here tonight have just learned that they were honorees and are very excited to showcase their product because this is some of the first time they may be getting some feedback about yeah. what they're going to be showcasing. In fact, right before we went on the air, we hear the hoots and hollers of people that got very excited about being one of the innovation's winners. And they're, they're all winners because they're innovating. They're doing some cool products, great things to talk about. As you know, we'll, we'll have as many of them on the air every year as we can, both here and at CES. Yes. But it is that excitement, as you say, building around CES season to also look at these cool new products that are going to get a lot of buzz. Yeah, they're actually the pro you know the products that will get a lot of buzz. They're also a good way to start kind of seeing some of the trends of what's happening at the show, you yeah. know, because this is kind of our first sneak peek of seeing some of the real hard devices that we'll be showing. Um, each year, and you know, and I think uh, this year was almost our it was our second largest number of entries in innovations. Wow! So we had almost a thousand products entered to uh, this contest, and and you know that that kind of sets an example for what we're expected to see, which is a sure. lot of cool new things this year. And a, and a quite a variety of products too. Mm -hmm. It's not like well, a thousand entries and nine hundred of them were tablets. You know, right. no, there's yeah. a lot of variety. Some were, some are various and sundry other things, from thermostats to just other cool stuff that we're going to see about and learn more about. That's absolutely true. And you know, each year we have to look at the categories of innovations and decide really, you know, how do we expand them because the the technology is growing in so many areas. And you mentioned thermostats. I yeah. mean, you know, there's so many so many cool things now where they can actually set the ambience to your room based on your mood and how you want your temperature to feel and everything else. And so, um, so you know, these are not just uh, what, what we thought of old-fashioned thermostats. These are definitely new high-tech green-saving devices. And, uh, and it's, it's fun to see. It's fun to see, you know, like I think this year one of, was one of our first years of having apps as a, as a category. Yeah, so, how cool is you that? You know, we always have to look at what's kind of next on the horizon and how can we bring that into the program. Gee, next year we'll have to uh, enter the Into Tomorrow app. <laughs> we'll you're right, to, we'll, you're right. We'll, we'll innovate some more. <laughs> I'm looking at Horatio, who's our app developer and also slash cameraman on this show. Uh, slashes uh, are good, right? Yeah, <laughs> slashes are good. We all wear 40 hats, so right. as you can know. In fact, I want to know a little bit more about uh, Karen Chupka, the person, because being in charge of all the events and conferences, and as I've said in your intro, far more than just CES, that's the biggie, of course. That's the one you all aspire to every year. But you and your team are always doing something cool having to do with consumer electronics and helping to promote this industry. What's your job like? You know, that's actually the fun part of our job. Um, you know, and I think my job specifically is, you know, I really get a chance to go and talk to many people throughout the world about what they're doing and what their plans are or how they're thinking of developing something or in some instances how they're promoting some new technology. And um, you know that's really a great opportunity. It's really great to just sit down with people who are energized about their product, happy about something that they're doing and really excited. 
to see how people react to it. And uh, not many people get to do that. So I'm a pretty lucky person. Uh, that's true. And I like to think we are, too, in that same You're vein. You're right. You get to do it, too. <laughs> doing this, the kinds of stuff you do and promoting an industry that is not only a lot of fun to talk about, but has so many cool products, we're never bored. Right. There's always <laughs> something new to talk about, to cover, to tell our audience about. Sometimes it's, oops, wait for version two. Not quite there yet, but it's still this industry and all the innovating going on and all the fun stuff happening. It, it, it is exciting. So, no, And, of course, right. you guys are doing a lot of seminars and a lot of various training things throughout the years. I mean, multiple events, but especially with our listeners, CES is the big one. Well, CES definitely gets the attention. I mean, it's it's the big party. Um, there's you know nothing else you could say about it. So, uh, yes, it is a time that everybody comes together. I mean, we have you know over 140,000 people from, um, I want to say, over 140 countries, yeah. 30,000 outside of the U.S., so it definitely gets the attention and is definitely the thing that's talked about the most. Yep. Certainly helps our economy, too. Yes. And especially <laughs> in and around Las Vegas area. It's, yeah. it's the only place that can hold this show, right? Absolutely. Especially in the United States. Yeah. It is just because of the number of hotel rooms and everything else that we need. And, wow. you know, it helps that Vegas is open 24 hours. It, so that does. Yeah. Our people who are suffering from jet lag can always get a hot meal. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> Very true. And then by that time, uh, t take a little 10-minute nap and then quick, get to the CES show floor. That's, that's right. kind of what we do every time. That's right. <laughs> Karen, you're a delight to chat with. Keep up the good work. Thanks for inviting us again here at Unveiled, and we'll spend the next three hours now talking to a whole lot of these 40 exhibitors about what they're going to be teasing us with for the international CES. Well, thanks, uh, thanks, Dave, and I know I'll see you out at CES, so good luck tonight. All righty. Thank you very much. We're back with more CESweb.org. For more information, of course, we'll link you there, too, when you hit us up at intotomorrow.com. I'm Dave Graveline, back with more from New York right after this.